What is up, YouTube? Lazy Llama here. And here we are playing some Kingdoms. Cool game. I played a little bit of it. Um, my first try, I got to day 10, so I was pretty happy about that. Um, but I want to do a YouTube series on it. Uh, I, I did watch slightly, slight bit of gameplay. Um, I am going to do this, just kind of show you guys what's up. So here we are. Um, if you haven't seen this game at all, it just came out today. Uh, you may have seen a couple people play uh, pre-release of it, but uh, if you haven't, uh, this is it. It's a side-scroller game where you literally just build up this kingdom. That might be a little too loud. Um, but yeah, it's just this game you kind of kind of roam around in, and uh, you'll see over here to the east, uh, we will hit the area where we will start our base. With this random gold that's just like trailed around our little pennies here that we start with that's our start we hire those two guys by dropping some gold we need to get one of them a bow once I pick it up it should let us build this one of those so we get one archer and one bowsman for the first day, and I believe it just has us throw up walls. That's all we really need. Um, the game is randomly generated every time, so you get a different experience every single time, and it is a—it uh, is quite a difficult one. I would not call it the easiest game in the world. Um, normally, you see kind of outside your village, you see these little camps. You want to run out to them as soon as you can um, to oh, expand, build, defend. I ain't taking that tree down yet. We don't want to spread too fast because um, these are just walls we're getting up. Um, I've learned through experience that uh, archers are very, very important early on. So those two guys I hired are, are both coming in to be archers. You can store up to four, bu uh, four tools on each rack. Um, and all I know so far, I don't know if there's any more, but all I know so far is that there are... Let's get this wall going again. We don't need a. We need the walls are more important than the towers, I think. Um, but we got two archers that are gonna go hunt. Um, but I think there's just uh, the engineers, um, the bowsmen, and farmers. I believe that's all there is. Uh, I don't know if there's any more than that. But we'll kind of see how long we can take the series and uh, just kind of go from there, you know. Uh, so the archers hunt, and they, they kill guys, and they get gold that way. Uh, farmers are a great source of income if you can get enough of them. I personally didn't get that many, but I've seen people do it. Bunnies don't run away. Um, there's also deer out there that do run away. This archer is very, very bad. Come on, man. There you go. Um, I really want to get this wall up because it is getting dark as you can see. The sun is going down back there. Um, and then some creatures come. Uh, I, I don't like when people go out too far at night. Um, it's very scary when you when you guys just, just walk off like this dude. Come back behind the walls that are being built. Uh, but normally they'll stand behind him. You can also hear where this rock is. You can put up a tower actually. He'll be inside the wall so the engineer can set that up tonight. You don't want to get him too fast because those archers don't hunt either. Um, I'm trying to think. I think last time I actually attacked from this side, which kind of sucks I didn't put my uh, tower on the side. But, ooh, we got walls really close. Oh, no, I did that before. Yeah, I'm going to say another tower and wall really close to each other. But I think that was how it's set up before, too, my last one. And you can see this one's kind of far out. Oh, we can't even build here yet. Uh, we need to take out, like, trees and stuff. Um... So it's a pretty fun game. Do I have three? Yes. We should be getting attacked by at least one of the bad guys. Yep, here they come. So basically, if they hit me when I have no gold, they knock my crown off. All right, we already beat them. Um, it gets a lot harder than that. <laughs> uh, you can't actually do anything. Again, it's just the upgrading that you'd worry about. But now I got two archer towers, two archers posted up. Um, it may be a little early for that because I think that means I only have two other archers roaming. Actually, I think I only have one other archer roaming. Crap. Probably shouldn't have did that yet. This hunting is going to be rough. 
Um, you can also upgrade the towers, and walls can go higher than this as well. Um, I have not gotten to them to get to that point, but I've seen them. When you hear those bells, um, a chest spawns in your base. It drops a ton, an absolute ton of gold. We're going to go see if we can pick up some more guys. We'll run a little bit more. Uh, i got to make sure I save some for bows. It is all about the bows right now to me. There's two guys here. I'm not going to have tools for all of them. But let's just get them. <clears throat> I think I can afford two bows. And I probably should make one of the three guys that just hired an engineer. Because engineers are important as well. Um, they can actually team up on things. Oh, cool. He's going to make that affordable. So get at least two bows and we have just enough for another, another one of those we do want to get our campfire upgraded because uh, it allows us to I think build more and farther I think um, I am still pretty new so I don't know completely um, I don't know how long I'm gonna make these videos they're probably gonna be 15 20 minutes long um, somewhere is about there um, I feel like I'm really close to this camp I'm not, I don't think I was that close before. It's really nice having one right there because it makes it really easy just to run out. Um, setting up this wall soon wouldn't be bad, but the more condensed you are, the more condensed your guys will kind of pile up. And when you're defending at one wall and a bunch of those little guys are trying to get in and they're all shooting, it seems to do better than if you have like them spread out. Because they normally just get through a wall and just demolish it. So I, I do try to get things going. I think it's coming to nighttime. Uh, I do have enough for that, though. Let's get that up. So we got a tent now. And I think this gets randomly... Uh, Randomly generated. I don't know what putting points into that does. Because I know once you upgrade your thing, which I can't do yet, um, you can't change the flag anymore. I don't know if this is to change the flag. or you, I mean, you can't upgrade the flag. So I don't know if it's used to change the flag or what. Um, but, you know, I don't really care what my flag looks like. That that looks kind of cool. What is it? supposed to be like a lion, a blue lion with a pink and black flag. Oh, you didn't have any gold, man. This guy's on this side in my last world didn't do very well either. I wanted to play the game for a little bit so I knew kind of what's up because I heard uh, I heard some pretty hard things about it. Man, he's this guy's fucking Robin Hood out here, getting everything. Maybe uh, actually hiring people at night isn't very good either. Um, if you hire them too late, then you can't seem to get them back to base in time. And they'll get attacked if that side gets attacked. Sometimes both sides get attacked too. So. Um. I have also encountered a, a red moon, I believe it's probably like a blood moon, kind of like in Terraria, um, and a giant horde seemed to come. Um, I've gotten two of those and that's actually what ended me. I survived my first one because it was on an earlier level, and then I died in like level 10 or 11. Come behind the wall please. Um, so they will knock the crown off your head if they hit you, if you have no gold. If you had gold, they'll drop gold, and then they'll take the gold and they'll leave. Um, they will also attack your guys and pick up the weapons if your guys get knocked back enough, or they'll kill your guy, and uh, they will steal your weapons as well. Um, it's quite uh, it's quite upsetting, actually. Yep. It looks like we got maybe two? Just two? That was really quick if it's just two. Maybe this side, too. I've seen them kind of come in, like, smaller kind of waves, so, like, you know, a couple show up, and then, you know, ten seconds later, more show up, so... I want to say we are in the clear though because the moon is almost out of sight. Um, I think we're going to run out to the right here again after we get our chest. Um, I kind of want to upgrade the towers, but I really think we're better off getting more people. Um, but they do seem to knock you guys out of the archer towers and especially when they're lower they seem to do it even more. Oh, there's the bells. And we can't actually see it, we can upgrade our fire again. Oh, got an achievement. I don't think that pops up on the screen. So just two. So let's grab these two guys. Let's see if we can find... There's a guy walking a horse out here. He's at one of the sides, randomly spawns. Um, and he brings a full set of tools to one of your racks. Uh, that scared me for a second. I didn't know what that was. Another one. There's three villages right here. Right, we're not going any farther just because I don't know what time of day it is. 
That's six new people. We aren't going to have jobs for them, but that's going to be a lot of archers in a small space, and I think that's going to be awesome. I think the last time I played, I progressed a little too fast. Just a little. Let's go buy some, uh... I don't want to get this wall up. Oh, I really got to arm these people. There were six coming, so there's four bows. I don't have enough for anything else. Um, so he's going to kill a rabbit, and then I can get it. I can either get another bowsman, or... We're not really expanding much yet. Let's just get another bow. Anyone else get some gold? You? Come on, you're outside here. I think until I clear this out, I don't think rabbits come on this side, to be honest. Bushes seem to pop up, like, once you, like, kind of own the zone. I guess you could call it owning the zone. We're going to have a ton of archers. You know what? Let's get that wall up. It's just going to be a level 1, because I can't afford to upgrade it. Uh, but it is something. Although, it's getting really dark and I probably shouldn't have did that. Everyone get inside. Please get this wall up. Just a level 1, but we have so many archers it might go okay. It may go over okay. We do need to worry about our... Um, our towers here very soon. That's going to be 10 points. We can get them higher up. You guys had to have gotten something. There's four of you. Nope. Not a single thing. But expanding to this wall would be great soon. Uh, I do want to condense, or I want to kind of get things going right inside my base first. But I don't like how they're sitting at this wall. It's not as protected, and there's no light. The lights come on the uh, the towers, it seems like. And actually, the higher walls, I think, get these torches. I think that's what happens. I don't hear anything. Do we have any guys just chilling around? We do. Just get that. We'll need him soon. Man, that's expensive. I'm going to start trying to do some upgrades. I don't really have much gold, but... So this wall is a must, and I want to get at least one of those inside towers, I think, done. I don't know how fast I want to expand. Oh, that was, that's what I wanted. Yeah, maybe I'll just get this. That's all my gold, though. I don't need more people yet. I do, but like, I, I don't have money to give them jobs or anything. Um, I don't know what upgrading this flag thing does. I don't know if it just changes it. I don't know if the flags like mean anything either. Last time I had like a like a hydra, I think it was like a three-headed like dragon or something. We got another guy posted up. Um, I believe the farm stand goes here if I upgrade my uh, my base one more time. We've got so many archers. Just nothing to kill. What is going on? Guys, give me gold. I got to uh, implement some taxes. And <laughs> uh, I do think I'm going to end this episode here. And uh, we'll start back up um, in just a moment.